Hello and welcome to this story strength at this time. I am Nolin Del Ame. The National Management Agency allows some states in the north central part of the country of a possible overflow of the river Niger that could trigger flooding the river and community. Benue, Kogi, Anambra, Delta, Imo, Rivers, and Bailsa are highly probable states. A statement by NEMA released on Friday says the notice is to allow local governments and communities to take actions to mitigate the risk of flooding. Some of the actions expected to be taken include immediate construction of temporary flood barriers, from flood plains to save higher grounds, and avoiding cross flooded areas. The agency advises communities to stay informed through weather updates and flood warnings from the National Meteorological Agency, NIMIT, the Hydrological Service Agency, NISA. This new right-wing Prime Minister, Michael Barnier, has promised to address the grievance of the French, but also implement change as he took office after almost a month of political deadlock. President Emmanuel Macron asked the 73-year-old politician with forming a government seen forward after July snap elections in which his country's alliance lost a relative majority in parliament. Earlier, the European Union's former Brexit negotiator and an ex-foreign minister, always premier in the history of modern France. He takes the five-year-old Gabriel Attal, a man less than half his served only eight months in office during a period of political turbulence and precedence in recent times in France. United States Climate Envoy John Podesta says plans are moving forward for time with China on using emissions of methane and other high polluting non carbon dioxide gases. Acknowledging some crisis, the two summits plans hold a summit on non carbon dioxide and lower carbons. Get less attention, but fully half of what's causing global warming, he said. China is the world's leader of climate change using greenhouse gases, including 10, followed by the United States. Climate talks often revolve around reducing the most dangerous. Greenhouse gas, carbon dioxide, but ten which is particularly potent, but relatively short, is a key target for countries wanting to slash emissions quickly and global climate change. The update from Hawaii, I am Lily Ebelani.